Thank you for checking out History X. My name is Stano, and today I want to cover two things. A channel I recently became familiar with and a correction that needs to be made. First, recently I've become familiar with Dan Greider, who operates the channel Probable Cause. Uh, previous to that, I would watch aviation channels that would provide landing techniques at airports I'm unfamiliar with. Um, I was also kind of into uh, channels that would uh, provide videos that would highlight uh, tips and tricks on certain types of avionics, all part of becoming a better pilot. But it wasn't until recently with the TBM Avenger water landing at Cocoa Beach that I came across Dan Greider. And since that time, I've tried to watch uh, two or three of his videos each day. Is Dan the real deal? I would definitely say that, yes, he is. And, and I'm a true fan and a, a subscriber. Uh, case in point, let me switch over. Dan um, recently posted a video about... Um, this pilot right here. <clears throat> uh, her name is Martha Lunkin, and her uh, he's commenting about her FAA checkride for the DC-3. Uh, in fact, Dan was on board for that. And that's the thing about Dan. He doesn't just comment on one's abilities as a pilot in his videos. Uh, he also provides firsthand accounts and additional insight uh, to back up his observations. And to me, that's important. Uh, in, in the case of this video, he mentions, uh, you know, how her particular size and weight, you know, could lead to um, an, an inherent inability to operate the DC-3, um, not only just in regular conditions, but, you know, also her ability to physically handle the DC-3 in the case of an emergency engine out, uh, where you really have to slam on the rudder. Um, so... I, I'm really impressed with Probable Cause. I'm really impressed with Dan. Uh, Dan should make anyone want to be a better pilot. Uh, and I recommend anyone with a serious interest in aviation to check out Dan's channel, Probable Cause. Uh, next and equally important, uh, there's a correction that I need to make concerning a recent video surrounding the TBM Avenger water landing at Cocoa Beach that I posted on Tuesday, this um, that would have been uh, this past Tuesday, April 27th. I posted a video highlighting previous events that involved um, uh, pilot's name was Terry Rush. He was the pilot of the TBM Avenger that made the water landing at Cocoa Beach. I want to thank, and actually, um, there's a picture of Terry Rush, the pilot that made the water landing at Cocoa Beach. I want to thank William uh, Tremblay, who commented on my channel, History X, about five hours ago, as well as R. Morse, uh, who commented about two hours ago, stating that one of the incidents that I uh, mentioned in that video involving a TBM Avenger at the EAA Oshkosh Air Show in 2006 did not, in fact, have Terry Rush at the controls. And that's the imagery you saw a couple of moments ago. So um, the point or the other, I rechecked the source that I used for that portion of the video and discovered it's no longer up online. Not sure what happened to it, but that's immaterial. Therefore, I have to conclude, uh, and with the help of William Tremblay and R. Morris making the comments on my channel earlier, that that portion of the video, my video is incorrect. Um, so I have removed the citation for that portion uh, from that video's description. And I also wanna post this retraction that I'm making right now. Uh, the TBM Avenger incidents involving Terry Rush are the flight with the disconnected fuel line in 2009, which is this incident right here, mentioned that in the video. And most recently, the water landing that we're all familiar with at Cocoa Beach last month. So I guess this is another lesson that, you know, we could all learn from Dan in this video here. Um, and I hope you can hear the audio. Where's the 
course, course somebody made a mistake, mistake. It's not very much to tell me about that. that. I know, I know because, because I make mistakes, mistakes all the time. All the time. Tell, tell me about it. it. If you, you look at the dictionary of word, the definition of mistake, it's got my picture. picture. I, do I do it all the time. time. However, I try to raise my hand and say that's me. I screwed up. I'm sorry. I'm trying to do better. It's a better policy. That's what I'm saying. And that's the policy I'm taking here. I hope you could hear that audio. Basically, Dan saying, look, if a mistake's been made, uh, figure out how to resolve it, get on it right away. And that's what I'm doing here. So I want to thank you for checking out uh, History X and hope everyone has a great night. Thank you for watching.